I'm here in a Catholic church in Switzerland, absolutely beautiful. Um, a little town just past, uh, just as, as you come in here in the south of Italy, very beautiful. But um, you have the beautiful old altars and then you have this modern altar here. I don't know if you can see this modern piece of cement or marble in the lectionary and the altar rail has been removed and then here you have these beautiful beautiful side altars actually the main altar here thankfully, thankfully they've left it untouched and it's very beautiful very very beautiful there is this there is this loss of Catholic identity, you know. If you ever go into a Greek Orthodox church or a Russian Orthodox church, you see these beautiful uh, iconoclasts. Uh, you know, the, the whole church speaks of the divine. Does that altar bring us to Christ? Does it inspire us to something? Or is it just so modern? Um, piece of marble that we've plunked in our beautiful churches. It doesn't, it doesn't add anything. It doesn't enkindle anything. It doesn't benefit anything. Whereas we have our beautiful church altar back there with so much beauty. You know, Catholics, we need to return to our Catholic identity. You know, this isn't this isn't our Catholic identity. That thing there which looks like an arrow. What does it speak to us as Catholics? What does it, you know? And I'm here doing this video in, in this beautiful church with our Lord present here in the Eucharist on the, on the high altar behind me. You know, our whole church, our whole church should speak to the beauty of the Eucharist. Catholic churches. This isn't about, this is about directing our worship towards our Lord, not towards the modern invention that we've put in the middle of our sanctuary. You know, our sanctuary used to be a place where, like in the old temple in Jerusalem, a priest would go and offer the sacrifice. And in the Mass, we offer the sacrifice, again, remembering Christ's sacrifice on Calvary. Does that, is that a dignified place to offer the sacrifice of the Mass? Or would we not do it on that other altar there with the cross in front of the priest? A priest leading us in prayer. You know, I hope someday Catholics will realise we have a beautiful heritage. We didn't need to destroy our churches. We didn't need to remove our altar rails here. We didn't need to put this here. Did it bring the faith back? Did it enkindle the faith? Did it make the faith stronger in, in Europe? No, it didn't. We just became semi-Protestant and we wonder why the faith is dying all over Europe because we no longer have an identity.